guys, welcome to Isaiah's Reviews. I got something a little different outside of what I normally do, and this is actually a piece of furniture. Uh, I bought this off of Kohl's.com, and uh, it was on clearance for 99 bucks. and what this is is a uh, five-tier uh, leaning uh, ladder shelf. The bottom's a uh, shelf is big and works us all the way up to the small size. Here it connects into the middle. The sides are not a solid piece up and down. You put it together. Uh, it joins in the middle with uh, four pegs, two in each uh, wooden spot. Uh, of course, two two stands on each side. Uh, it's, the reason why I'm doing this video is because it was uh, very affordable. It was 99 bucks on uh, Kohl's, but I was able to use stackable coupons, um, two of them to be exact. Brought the price down to 70 bucks with free shipping. Now, I'm not sure if that offer still stands, but I know a lot of these things, they're like a no-name brand and whatnot, but I was able to find the website that makes them, or the company, so the link will be down in the description for that. Now, the measurements for this thing is 72 inches high. I'm 5'11", so you can see it's pretty tall, and uh, about 24 inches wide. Now, it's pretty hefty. I think it's about 70 pounds, so whenever you put it together, uh, you may need someone to help you kind of move it around. Uh, I didn't. Uh, but uh, you may have to. Alright, so also when you put it together, I went ahead and put the side pieces on uh, uh, first and put these uh, little pegs in and stuff and made the uh, sides. And then I laid it down and put each shelf in. I uh, went ahead and fully tightened down one side. Uh, you may not want to do that. I think I got lucky. Uh, when I put the other side onto it, uh, it lined up. Everything worked out great. But you may want to hold off on doing tightening all of it together. Now for your tools list, you'll need a rubber mallet, I suggest, and that's for beating these uh, side pieces down um, into the four wood pegs that you get per side, and there's wood glue to, to kind of hold these side pieces down. Uh, so you'll need a rubber mallet, uh, power drill is what I have with the hex uh, key head on it. Um, I'm not sure what size exactly, but I, I have one in some set that I had, so you'll probably have one at home too. But they do include a hex key itself. Uh, Phillips head screwdriver, that's for the wood screws. Um, there's only four of those that you'll put into the piece of furniture itself, and that's just to kind of hold, help hold these side pieces together at the conjoining point in the middle there. And that's really about it as far as the tools you'll have to have. So I think assemble time for me was about 30 minutes. So uh, it was very easy to put together and quick. So that was a big plus as well. But this is a tobacco finish on a wood veneer. So, uh, but it looks really nice. I don't know about long term or whatever, but for right now, I mean, I can't imagine it. Uh, it's very, very stable. So I can't imagine anything happening to it. But if if you're not content with that, it does include some stuff up here where you can mount the top piece on each side to the wall. Uh, in case you got kids, I guess, that want to climb around or whatever, you won't pull some of your valuables over uh, onto them or whatever. Solid piece of furniture, and I was really surprised at the price of 70 bucks. So I was just wanting to uh, let you know about that. The box that ships in also is kind of thin. I think it's maybe about three or four feet tall. Uh, so it's not that big and bulky to, to handle and maneuver around, but uh, yeah, I kind of like it. was really surprised at the quality. Uh, the color looks great. Everything about it's great, so it's a definite plus uh, for this thing and a good buy. So this has been the five-tier leaning shelf that I purchased from Kohl's.com. This has been another Isaiah's Reviews. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you did, like, subscribe, and share this to all your social sites. That helps get me to places I can't get to on my own, and I really do appreciate that, and I can't wait to see you again here on Isaiah's Reviews.